Hello, so if you go to webhobby.com, you can uh, see a lot of basic demonstration videos of how to extract data from websites and most of these videos are slow paced uh, with text details so you should be able to follow and there is also a help section which is actually a tutorial of the program and this actually guides you through the various features and how to use them in various scenarios so coming to the requirement uh, this is a silo website and uh, silo is not a simple website to scrap there is a specific technique involved to get data from silo so it's not trivial so I will guide you through the steps the first step is actually to load the website in another browser like Chrome so I have actually searched for the location which you have uh, requested and this is the listings page and if I scroll down I can see uh, the links to the subsequent pages now click on uh, the link to load the second page and get its address and paste this in any text editor you can see that uh, the ending part of the address uh, contains the page number which is 2 in this case I'll change it to 1 and uh, copy this and load this uh, URL directly in WebHavi. So alright, so we have now loaded the same uh, listing page within WebHavi. Now we can start configuration by clicking the start config button. Now click on uh, the first uh, listing click this button here which actually gets more data from the area we clicked so now you can see the details of the first listing let's just select only the first line using mouse and then click the capture text button let's give a name for this field title and click OK so now we probably have uh, selected all uh, the remaining listings automatically as you can see in the preview area here so now we need to get this uh, data from uh, multiple listing pages so what we do here is we go back to the text, text editor and we replace uh, this page number portion with a code get this URL copy and then go to web Harvey open edit menu edit options add remove URLs from configuration and uh, paste the URL string here and click the apply button and to get detailed data from each listing click on the first listing again click the capture more content button up here click the capture HTML button right next to it and then click the apply regex button for the towards the right and you need to copy this regular expression and apply it so now the follow this link button will be enabled click on it to load the listing details page now we can select further information from this page for example click the address portion and click the capture text to get the field bets
area Sestimate to get the Sestimate correctly it is recommended that you click on this title Sestimate and click on this icon here which actually gets the data or the text which follows this heading and then click the capture text button you can directly click on the price and select capture text alright so now we have uh, selected almost all required data from this page now click the stop config toolbar button to stop configuration so now we have created a configuration click the start mine button to start mining data using this configuration you, you can also now optionally save this configuration as a file if you want to run it later so here we are uh, just going to run this configuration click the start mine button and uh, you should actually specify the number of pages from which you need data so this will get uh, property details from 10 listing pages each page contains multiple listings as we have seen I click the start button so as you can see it's uh, loading the first page of listings and it got all the titles now it will follow each of this listing to load its uh, details page and get data so I hope this video is useful I will copy all the strings the URL strings and the regular expressions used in this video uh, in the support mail let me know if you have any questions